My wealth is none of your business. Oh, but that's where you're wrong, lad. What? Wealth is my business. Maybe you'd like a taste. No, I'm not interested. And I won't ever be. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. Nomadis. A nice cabin is just ahead. There's been a report or some confusion, concern, I'm not sure what, that a little girl has gone missing. So we're here to check it out. And we're not far from Riverwood. Here is a Anais Cabin, Anis Cabin. You tell me how to pronounce it. And Riverwood is just here across the river, pretty much. A stone's throw. All right. Nematus, I think you should wait here. What can I do for you? Very well. Just be careful. Thank you. I don't want to, uh, antagonize or intimidate this woman. Anise? I'm just a poor old woman, dear. No need to trouble yourself with me. Really? Is that all? It's so nice to have a visitor. Do you know anything? Well, I'm not going to say anything. Let me... Do you mind if I look around? I'm... Someone's concerned. Anise. It's so nice to have a visitor. All right, very well. Be careful! I am being careful. Wow, it feels good to have Nematus watching from a distance in case there's any trouble. Mmm, vegetable soup. I could use some of that. Song of the Alchemist. Hmm. something to sleep here with the window right here that something could just reach inside and grab you like a, a, a grizzly bear hmm, what's this looks like this was an attempt to conceal it well, let me go ahead and pick the lock she won't notice me coming in here since she's busy tending the garden. Oh, look at this. Magical things. Nice. Kunzite. I'm not familiar with that. Hmm, here's a letter. Helgi, dear, why do you hesitate? You can feel the power coursing in your blood. You have only to reach out and grasp it. Renounce that boy of yours and come. Come live with me in the forest. My sister will be here soon. Together we can perform a proper coven, and your training will truly begin. Hmm. I'm not sure what that means. Did the girl come here and... Now she's dead and missing? Alright, let me go up here and talk to Anise about this. Oh, 
And it, what? Oh. Secret. What it? I really don't know what your secret is. have been something terrible for you to die for it. So I guess I was right. Maybe the girl did come here? Oh, who knows? Hmm. So it's still considered stealing even though the owner of this home is dead. Oh well. I'll just leave everything. Well, this book taking it. And what's in here? Moon sugar. Taking that too. And this... Oh, it's just a petty gem. I'll leave it. Okay. Thanks for standing by, Nematis. Finally. Onward to our next adventure. That's right. And, as much as it pains me, our next stop is Riften. There's a bounty that I need to I'm pick up here. there. Yes, I know. There's a bounty that I need to pick up there, and I know that that city is just rumored to be corrupt and evil. But it's time that I go and visit there. All right, Dreadborn Landing looks like the closest we can get to Riften. All right, Dr. Bombay. And here's the follower, Dreadborn Knight. Let's um, just ride and see what's up here. We have some undiscovered areas on the map. Oh, Fort Greenwald, okay. Sounds like fighting going on inside. So what is this little city here? Oh, sure stone, okay. Let's uh, see if we can't find Riften. Well, there's something else over here, though. Never been to this part of uh, Skyrim before. that wall. Oh, this looks like a Spriggan area. Alright, let me just discover it. Okay, Autumn Shade Clearing. Get us out of here, Dr. Bombay! What's this? Is this some sort of ritual area, too? these things.
looks like I am. Sir. There's someone there? Ebony unarmored robe will take this. Now, let's see what they were doing over here. Really? Is this a, a spell book? Skill book? It is. I never knew that about restoration. We'll take the fire salts. It's a good thing I stopped. All right, Dr. Bombay. The Mattis, I take it you've lost your, your horse. All right, okay. Follow us then. Let's see if we can't find our way. Riften should be somewhere in this direction. According to the map, there's another house or something up here. Let me see what this is. Uh-oh. <laughs> More bears! Just keep moving. What's this area here? Mary Fair Farm. Are the bears still after us? Oh, there it's Nematus. I'd like to discover whatever that is. Oh my goodness, here come the bears again. It. There's no bridge or anything. There's a, a boat here. Oh well. This isn't the way to rift in anyway. Come on. It's back this way. Let's 
Let's see if we can avoid these bears. The city seems masked from me. It's odd. Hold there. What? Before I let you into Riften, you need to pay the visitor's tax. A tax? What's the tax for? For the privilege of entering the city. What does it matter? Okay. I've heard nothing but bad things about this city. And I think it's obvious that you're just not an ordinary guard, but a thief. You should know that I kill thieves. All right, calm down. No need for that. I'll let you in right away. Just need to get the gate unlocked. Welcome to Riften. The gate's unlocked. You can head inside when you're ready. All right, Nomadus, let's go. I had another run-in with a thief's guild. Be careful, Leo. The Thieves' Guild has Maven Blackbriar at its back. One snap of her fingers and you could end up in Riften Jail. Or worse. They represent the reason I'm here. I can't just ignore them, Meren. I know. I just don't want you to leave. You're the only good thing that's happened to this city in a long time. Excuse you me. You keep your distance with that magic. That spell looks dangerous. Keep your distance. Excuse me, ma'am. Can you tell me about Riften's Thieves' Guild? To call it a guild is ridiculous. How can people who would betray one another over a gold coin be considered part of an association? They're the worst kind. Even the Dark Brotherhood abides by a strict set of rules and tradition. These thieves are just rabble. What do you think? Well, I agree completely. You know, I'm beginning to respect you. Other than Eren, you seem to be the only other person I've met I might be able to trust. Since we share the same opinion of them, let me warn you that they're recruiting others to join their guild, and you should be cautious. I thank you for the warning. Can you tell me about the Blackbriar family? Maven Blackbriar, the matriarch of the family, represents everything that's wrong with this city. She's bribed countless officials, has friends back in the Imperial City, and freely associates with the Thieves' Guild. I've tried everything I can to protect Riften citizens from her family, but to no avail. Who else is in the family? Well, there is Ingwen Blackbriar. Maven's daughter. Strange girl. She likes to spend time down in Elgrim's elixirs working on her alchemy. Then you have Hemming, Maven's son. Spoiled brat and heir to her empire. He follows her word like a loyal dog follows its master. And finally, Sibi. The worst of all of them. He's in Riften jail for murder. Murder? Okay. So, I take it you're not from Riften? I've been adventuring across Tamriel since I was a fresh-faced young woman, barely able to swing a blade. My travels have taken me from High Rock to Vellenwood, elsewhere to Morrowind, and all points in between. And why are you here, then? 
Many years ago, I lost my blade, Grim Sever, within a Dwemer ruin. I took it as a sign that I was wasting my days in search of wealth. You and I are alike. We seek challenge and great fortune. But for me, that's where the similarities end. You see, Riften is my great beast to be slain. And my fortune comes from gratitude and trust. So then you're Riften's protector. It's been difficult. I've taken the burdens of this city's problems upon myself, and I keep running into impossible obstacles. Corruption, lies and deceit are the order of the day here. If it wasn't for Erin, the young man who saved my life, I think I'd already have given up long ago. And how did Erin save your life? It was Erin who found me dying outside of a Dwemer ruin. If he hadn't brought me here and nursed me back to health, I would have died. When my strength returned and he told me about the problems plaguing Lifton, I decided fate brought me here for a reason. So I stayed. All right, well, it's certainly been a pleasure meeting you. Safe travels. And to you. Okay, Nomadis, don't just stand there. Come on. Hey, you. Get over here. I want to talk to you. What? Me? Yes. I don't know you. You and Riften looking for trouble? Um, actually, I'm here to see the Jarl about a bounty. Yeah? Well, I got news for you. There's nothing to see here. Last thing the Black Briars need is some stranger sticking their nose where it doesn't belong. And who are the Black Briars again? The Black Briars have rifted in their pocket and the Thieves Guild watching their back. So keep your nose out of their business. Me? I'm Maul. I watch the streets for them. If you need dirt on anything, I'm your guy. But it'll cost you. Hmm. Well, I'm just gonna stay out of your way. Suit yourself. I'll be at the docks if you change your mind. You aren't worth my time. Piss off. Hmm. I was gonna ask him about the gym, but... I'm really getting tired of your excuses. I guess when you I borrowed can't now. Me, you said you'd pay it back on time and for double the usual fee. I know I did. But how was I to know the shipment would get robbed? Next time, keep your plans quieter. And you in town, eh? Here for what? the teaching, I guess. Are you telling me you robbed it? Why? Why yes, are you doing this I to me? Suppose. Look, Shadra, last What's going one. On pay here? up or else. All I care about is the gold. Everything else is your problem. Young man, what's going on here? Huh? What do you want? Okay, don't take that tone with me. I'm trying to see if you're in some kind of trouble. I owe a great deal of money to someone, and I think they cheated me. I don't know what to do. Tell me the details. I was able to work out a deal with the stables in Whiterun to sell me some of their tack and harnesses. I borrowed some gold from Sapphire to pay for the shipment, but it got robbed before it even arrived. Now, Sapphire wants her money back, and if I don't pay her, I think she's going to kill me. All right. I will help to pay off your debt, since you, you're young and fairly innocent. You will? Oh, thank you. And... Nomadis, can I talk to the young man, please? Um, you work at the stables? Yes. Hofgreer took me in when I arrived in Riften about a year ago. He's been teaching me everything he knows. Horses are my whole life. Back in Hammerfell, I helped my family raise horses at our farm. I hope to open my own stables one day. 
but I think it's going to take a lot longer than I expected. All right, well, let me take care of this trouble that you're in. Be careful with Sapphire. She mixes with all sorts of nasty people. And you should follow your own advice. Got the coin? You've come to the right place. Pull up a seat. People of Riften. What's going on? Heed my words. The return of the dragons is not mere coincidence. This is one of the signs. The signs that Lady Mara is displeased with your constant inebriation. I'm still here. Put down here. your flagons filled with your vile liquids and embrace the teachings of the Handmaiden of Kain. No, no, Marama. We talked about this. Talon? Kirava, certainly we can come to some sort of an understanding. These people must be made aware of the chaos they've sown. Enough, Marama. We've all heard of the dragons and their return. There's no need to use them as an excuse to harass our customers. Very well, Talon. I'll remove myself from this den of iniquity. We're not kicking you out. Just keep the sermons at the temple and let us all sin in peace. Never done an honest day's work in your life for all that coin you're carrying, eh, lad? Excuse me? I'm saying you've got the coin, but you didn't earn a septum of it honestly. I can tell. Well, you're wrong. I do a lot of good deeds for people, and that's how I earn my money. Besides that, my wealth is none of your business. Oh, but that's where you're wrong, lad. What? Wealth is my business. Maybe you'd like a taste. No, I'm not interested. And I won't ever be. Sorry. I usually have a nose for this kind of thing. All right, you, young lady. Yeah, what's your problem? I wanted to talk about Satter's debt. Shatter, whatever his name is. His debt. I knew that stupid kid would try and find a way to weasel out of his debt. Look, this is really simple. I lent him some gold, he promised to pay me back, and now he says he's broke. End of story. You and I both know this is a setup. All right, all right. I guess I made enough from his shipment. No need to waste any more time threatening a stable hand. Tell Shadra he doesn't owe me anything. That'll teach me to try and make extra coin around this city. All right, so that should take care of Shadra. We need to get a room. Hello. If you've got the coin, you're welcome here. Otherwise, hit the road. What's the word around town? Mjol the Lioness used to adventure across Skyrim before she settled down in Riften. I hear it all ended when she lost her enchanted blade. Hmm. Anything else going on? Crime is an all-time high in this city thanks to the Thieves' Guild. Don't we have enough problems with the war going on? Anything else? Rifton's biggest exports used to be fishing and honey until the Blackbriar family moved in. Now the meadery is the biggest game in town. Is there anything else that you want to tell me? Sibby Blackbriar is furious that his ex-lover tried to murder him. He's leaving no stone unturned searching for her. Anything else? The Thieves' Guild has been pushing hard to regain a foothold in this city. Rumor has it they're falling apart from the inside. Alright, anyhow, I'd like to chat all night, but I'm, I'm kind of tired. I'd like to rent a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room. Right this way. Thank you.
Let me know if there's anything else you need. Okay, thank you. If you've got the coin, you're welcome here. Otherwise, hit the road. And good night to you, too. All right, Nematis, I'll see you in the morning. find out where the Jarl is. What is this? Mara smiles upon you. Ta Talon G? I've checked with Mara Mal and I'm certain an arrangement can be made to incorporate the traditional Argonian bonding ceremony should the need arise. It would be our pleasure to receive you at the temple and to have Mara Mal Perform a marriage ceremony between yourself and Kirava, but we'd request the appropriate tithe be made, as we previously discussed. Whatever you decide, I wish both the best of luck and hope to see you here soon. And whoever Dinya Balu signed this. I'm not stealing it. A dream of Sovngarde. Hmm. Oh, we're in the man's room. Oh, I'm sorry. We're leaving now. <coughs> Amatis, come on. This is all your fault. We're all up in the man's business. This is a nice marketplace. Good morning. My food is the best in all of Skyrim. Always as fresh as the day it was collected. And how do you keep this food so fresh? I picked up a trick from a butcher in Elenir, a small town over the border in Hammerfell. He showed me a way to grind up ice wraith teeth and use it as a preservative. Keeps everything cold and fresh, but only for a limited time. I'm always looking to replenish my supply, so if you ever come across five of them, I'd be more than happy to take them off your hands. Okay, I, I come across Ice Wraith Teeth on occasion, and I, I know what you're talking about. They are excellent for refrigeration. Thanks. I was actually worried I'd run out. And I just happen to have five in my satchel here. Perfect, just perfect. These should help keep my stock fresh for quite a while. And as promised, here's my trade. Hope you like it. Okay. May your path be free from danger. It's missing, so Grelka must have it. I wish this town would right, no stop pointing their fingers at me. There go over here. I think this is, um, actually... Wait, was that, um, yeah, it's, this is the young man. What is it, Sh Shadra? You're no longer in debt with Sapphire. Eight? You actually talked her into it? I don't know what to say. I didn't think anyone in Riften even cared what happened to me. Look, I was saving this, but I wanted you to have it. I thought I might need it if Sapphire came for me, but I don't need it anymore. Um, thank you. An invisibility potion. That's so thoughtful. I wonder what you were planning on doing with it. You in town, eh? Here for the fishing, I guess. No. There's nothing like fishing on Lake Onrek. You should try it sometime. To stay alive. You're a fisherman? Only the best in all of Riften. I own Riften Fishery. Started out with a single fishing pole and now I have an entire building and two boats to my name. 
Not bad for a middle-aged Nord, eh? Too bad I haven't had the same success helping this city shed its poverty. And even Nord thinks I'm wasting my time trying. But I disagree. You sound quite charitable. Yes, I suppose someone has to be around here. Have you seen the condition of this sorry excuse for a city? Beggars roam the streets, crime runs rampant, and the threat of war is driving away business. The paltry amount of coin that I place in the charity box at the temple is the least I can do to help. And who buys all your fish? I sell my catch across a good portion of Skyrim. It's worth its weight in Looking gold to me. Alive? The only untapped market left is Markar. However, I just got word that Klepper at the Silver Blood Inn might be interested. If you're headed that way, I would appreciate you delivering a purchase agreement for me. You'd be paid, of course. Of course. And, okay, I'll do it. Good. Klepper will pay you as soon as you arrive with the letter. Here you are. Remember to give at the temple. Protect yourself Hello right. there. Armor Greetings, broken. honored friend. Could I interest you in some fine jewelry? Do you make your own jewelry? I do. Sadly, I'm one of the few traditional Saxlil jewelers that remains in Tamriel. It's becoming a lost art. Only trouble is gathering materials has become hazardous. The roads to the mines and to the other cities are thick with bandits, and worse. Would you be interested in gathering some materials for me? I'd certainly be happy to compensate you. Sure, I'll get them for you. Thank you, Land Strider. I'm seeking a small list of items to complete my next creation. Two flawless sapphires, a mammoth tusk, and a chunk of gold ore. Okay, well, I have happen to have two flawless sapphires in my satchel. Good. Here. These will make wonderful settings for my rings. I also happen to be carrying a mammoth tusk. The ivory from this tusk will be perfect for the inlay on my amulets. All right, well, I think that'll be it. I'll have to look for your gold. All right. Um, where did Nematis go? Well, anyway. Right, I'm told the Jarl resides here, at Mistvale Keep. Have our scouts come up with any information on these reports of dragons? Yes, my lady. That unpleasantness at Helgen supposedly involved Hello. a dragon. It Did we have an appointment? No. no. I want you to speak was a delivery? To I can't Make sure remember. there's a contingency plan in effect. Excuse me, Anne Urel? Anne Urel? Welcome to Mistvale Keep. I'm Jarl Layla's steward, Anne Urel. And Uriel, I'm here to collect the bounty. The leader at Trevia's watch is dead. Excellent. You've done us a great service. Here is your reward. Yes, my lady. Thank you. I've also taken the liberty in preparing a private carriage, just in case. Good. Oh, if Riften should her. fall, it's only right that its leader be spared. Yarl? Welcome to Riften, Traveler. I hope the road fared well for you. What is your stance on the war? While I feel Ulfric's cause is just, my concern is for the people of the Rift. How can they continue to lead their already meager lives with dark clouds looming overhead? My heart goes out to them. If only our coffers were deeper, I could protect them as they were my own family. And what of Ulfric himself? With the Stormcloaks at his back, Ulfric's poised to rid Skyrim of the Empire's forces and invalidate our involvement with the White Gold Concordat. Many have died taking up arms for this cause. I fear that the land will be stained with blood for years to come. And what is the White Gold Concordat? Surely you're aware of the great war between the Imperials and the Elves who called themselves the Aldmeri Dominion? When the smoke cleared, the White Gold Concordat was signed. 
It was supposedly a treaty aimed at establishing peace within the Empire. One of the terms of the treaty was the outlawing of worship to Talos. To the Stormcloaks, this was viewed as the moment when the Empire became unworthy of the allegiance of any true Nord. And what's going on with this city and the Thieves' Guild? We're all eager to see them brought to justice. Maven Blackbriar has assured me that they're being dealt with appropriately. As one of our city's most influential citizens, she's taken it upon herself to oversee their incarceration. Sadly, they're proving elusive, but I have confidence that Maven won't give up until this city has been rid of them all. Hmm. Very well. Good journey to you. Did we have an appointment? No. Um, no. Just leaving. Was it delivery? Come on, I Nematis. I can't believe you sat down and are eating at their table. Let's go. Alright, well, I think our business here in Riften is done. Is there anything you want to do while we're here, Nomadis? Oh well, let's go. Alright, well our trip to Riften wasn't as painful as I thought it was going to be. Is that... Sounds like a Khajiit over here. Hmm until we know the limits of our courage we don't really know ourselves all right well we may explore the area here for a bit but then it's time to see who else needs our assistance all right nomadis let's go